Hey everybody, welcome back to the Heretic Circle channel. It is I, Jack, and what I wanted to talk about today, or actually review, discuss, whatever you want to talk, whatever, however you want to call it. Um, I wanted to introduce you guys to this amazing grindcore band from Singapore called Warm Rock. They released about a week ago, actually. It says here July 8th. So it's been a little bit more than a week. Um, their brand new album called Hiss. Um, one, of my, uh, one of my friends actually posted about the band. And I saw the cover and I was like, that is, that's a fucking awesome cover. And you know how it goes when it comes to metal. If you have an awesome cover, you're going to be intrigued and you want to hear it. So I went to Spotify. I looked it up and I was like, all right, let's 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 dive in. It's, it's about a 30 minute album. It's Grindcore. What do you expect? Fuck was I blown away. Oh, my God. Well, that, that album is fucking amazing. It's great. So uh, they have a trilogy music video on YouTube. So... I say, let's check it out. Let, let, let's see how this is. Um, of course, you know how YouTube is. So I'm going to be coming in and out, stopping, discussing, because that's what we're here to do. We're here to discuss. So we'll be discussing this trilogy music video for the songs Grieve, Whipping Willow, and Voiceless Choir. This is going to be interesting. All right. They are on... They're on Eric, so I mean, Eric usually gets the great bands, you know. I mean, hell, Napalm's there, so they're 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 in good company. So let's check this out. That's straight out of the cover, that's for sure. All right, I gotta stop it here for a little bit. That's this is one of the things that struck me about the album, the violin. Oh, I'm a sucker for the violin, especially if you integrate it into metal properly. Oh, I love it. I love it. Um, I'll be a uh, uh, brief story. So, one of the one of the first albums I really heard that had a violin in it. Um, actually it was when I was getting into black metal, um, just diving all over the place. It wasn't Demu. It wasn't Demu Bergier actually. It, it ended up being on a death metal album, uh, at the gates. Um, what is it? The, the, the red in the sky is ours. I believe, um, it has just this single violin and it sounded so amazing. I was like, oh, oh that's awesome. So to hear violin on the, on a metal song or Whatever it may be, if it's done right, you sold me. I dig the fact that this is like... Uh, a little bit of a movie. You don't get music videos like these anymore. This is awesome. I'm getting a sense of crooked cops here. Oh! Motherfuckers! Motherfuckers! It just goes to show, <laughs> no matter what country you're in, there's corruption everywhere. Oh, that's fucked up.
also, uh, this is an amazing thing about this band. It's a three piece, drums, guitar, and vocal, no bass. So they're kind of doing what Pig Destroyer used to do uh, before they added a bassist and they added a, a, a samplist, a samplist keyboardist. So they're kind of going the, the, the way of, you know, old Pig Destroyer. And this sounds great. So, I mean, fuck. Oh, shit, look at that. <laughs> I kind of see where this is going, right? <laughs> it kind of right now, going based off the intro, the cover, you kind of see where this is going. It's a vengeance tale. Ooh. All right, before we start, oh, okay, that is, that shows you vengeance right there. Didn't straight up kill him. Didn't straight up go for like the throat or the heart. No, 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 no. Not even goes for your balls. No, I'm going for your thigh. Get you hurt, scared, and then, oh, that's awesome. I'm a stickler for these things, but that is a continuity error if I ever saw one. But I love the groove of the song. The solo, I fucking love this. The groove is great. The the music video, I mean, like I said, you don't get music videos like this anymore. And that's one of the things I miss about, you know, back in the day when music videos kind of had a story element to their songs. That just elevates the song even higher. This is doing kind of that. They're taking it kind of old school in a sense. Cool, that little melody right there. Hell yeah. Ah, let's do one more. Very Michael Myers right there. You gotta admit, right? She's just walking. He's running. She's just walking like, don't worry. You can run. You're not gonna hide. And you know how this is gonna end. Ah! <laughs> I'm telling you, such a Michael Myers thing. You gotta admit, that's a little bit of an honorable thing because instead of just shooting her to death, he's like, you know what? I'm gonna try to fight you. You know? <laughs> it says something. I think it says something. I mean, given our current times here in the United States, you know, 
how things used to be done, how things were settled back in the days. And I'm not condoning violence, but I mean, you just sometimes fighting with your fists were the thing, I guess. I don't know. What I'm just saying is cool. <laughs> My mind, MMA move right there. Oh, he's gonna tap out. Oh, ah, oh, that was cool. That was that was really cool. <laughs> well, there you go. There you go. That is Worm Rot with their trilogy music video for Grieve, Whipping Willow, and Voiceless Choir. Like I said, the album Hiss. Um, it's an amazing album. It's really, really good. One of my favorite tracks on it is actually the very last one. Uh, called Glass Shards. The violin in that track. Oh, so good. Seriously, um, the album came out a week ago on July 8th on um, Eric Records. Go check it out. Go to your streaming platforms. Um, buy the record. There's apparently, if you go to, um, if you go to um, like Metal Archives, uh, apparently there's, a couple of different versions of it, uh, four different vinyl covers. Uh, there's a digipack. Uh, apparently, I think the CD has a hand signed photo card. So there's a couple different special uh, versions of it for you collectors out there. But seriously, check them out. So good, so good. Worm rot. So there you go. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of the songs? What do you guys think of the band? Um, I've heard a couple of other songs from them, uh, when, after I heard, finished re you know, hearing the album, a couple of other songs came up from previous records, really good stuff. Apparently they actually broke up for a while. They are from what metal metal archives has. They were from 2007 to 2012 stopped, restarted 2013 to current. So, yeah. Great band from Singapore, Grindcore. I can't wait to hear more. Seriously. What would you guys think? Leave a comment below. Give me a recommendation too. What else? What other Grindcore bands from other countries have you discovered? Well, and it doesn't have to be Grindcore either. Death Metal, Black Metal, whatever. Leave a comment below. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, share this everywhere. If you're looking for collectible uh, records check out hereticscircle.com the link will be in the description you might find something there with some cool shirts stuff faith hey, you know stuff cool stuff either way thank you for watching and i'll see you next time